All right, thanks, Dina. At least two people are safe right now after escaping an early morning fire which destroyed two RVs in Stockton. Fire officials say the survivors were apparently living in those motorhomes. Fox 13 Scott McCain is in Stockton with the very latest. The Stockton fire chief telling Fox 13 that, you know, the good news is the two folks who were there, they survived, but he also hopes this serves as a warning for anyone out there who happens to be using an RV or a motor home for permanent occupancy right now, especially during these frigid winter months. This is the scene which greeted volunteer fire crews early this morning after a passerby spotted the flames about 6.45 a.m. Now those crews were able to quickly douse the flames and keep them from spreading to a nearby home. No one was on scene at the time, but the fire chief says each of the RVs appears to have been occupied at the time of the fires. Yeah, it looks like they were uh, living in those uh, RVs or at least staying there. Um, reports were they'd been there for a while. Um, we believe an electrical component. Uh, we had a lot of extension cords on the ground, ran back to the house with alternative uh, uh, heat sources there. The chief goes on to say that the first word in RV is recreation and that they are typically not built to withstand full time occupancy, especially when it gets very cold. The formal investigation is currently underway to try to figure out exactly what caused these two RVs to go up in flames this morning. They're also trying to track down the two folks who survived the fires. They say if anyone out there knows who they are, where they are, or if you happen to be those individuals, Stockton PD would like to hear from you. In Stockton, Scott McCain, Fox 13 News, Utah.